Hello everyone, welcome back to Mind and Marvels. Today we are going to talk about solitude and mental health. In other words, how being alone can improve your mental health. In today's fast-paced world, we are always surrounded by people and technology. We often forget to take some time out for ourselves. Spending time alone can sometimes be viewed as a negative thing. But it can be an excellent tool for self-care and stress relief. Let's first understand the science behind solitude and mental health. Research shows that spending time alone can have many benefits for our mental health. It can help reduce stress levels, improve creativity, and enhance self-awareness. It can also lead to improved memory and concentration. And even better decision-making skills. When we are alone, we can focus on our thoughts, feelings, and emotions without any distraction. It can help us understand ourselves better, and we can identify our needs. It gives us the opportunity to reflect on our lives and make positive changes. However, there are still some common myths about spending time alone. One of the most common myths is that being alone indicates that someone is lonely or antisocial. This is not true. Many people who enjoy spending time alone are actually very social and have an active social life. Another myth is that solitude is a selfish act, but in reality, it can help us become better caregivers. And be more empathetic towards others. Now, let's discuss some practical strategies for practicing solitude. There are many ways to find alone time, such as meditation, journaling, going for a walk, or disconnecting from technology. Finding ways to incorporate solitude into your daily life can help you reap the benefits of this practice and improve your mental health. While solitude can be beneficial, it is important to differentiate it from isolation. Isolation is when we cut ourselves off from social interaction and become completely alone. This can have serious negative effects on our mental health. Studies have shown that isolation can lead to depression, anxiety, and other mental disorders. It is important to maintain social connections and seek help if you're feeling isolated or lonely. The key to reaping the benefits of solitude without falling into isolation is to find balance. It's important to take time for yourself and enjoy your own company, but also maintain social connections and engage in activities that bring you joy. Finding balance is essential for maintaining good mental health. Let's now share some examples of how spending time alone has helped improve mental health, creativity, and overall well-being. To start with, taking a solo trip can be a transformative experience that helps you gain new perspectives and insights. Another example would be to join a club or group that aligns with your interests, or even volunteering in your community, or. Simply taking a few minutes each day to meditate and reflect, this can help reduce stress levels and improve overall well-being. Do you want to know how to practice solitude in your daily life? Here are some tips. First, set aside a specific time and space for alone time each day. This can be as simple as taking a walk by yourself or spending 10 minutes meditating. Second. Try to limit your exposure to social media and technology, which can be major distractions. Third, find activities that you enjoy doing alone, such as reading, writing, or taking a relaxing bath. By incorporating these tips into your daily routine, you can cultivate a sense of calm and inner peace through the practice of solitude. Lastly. It is important to understand that self-care is not selfish. It is easy to get caught up in the hustle and bustle of everyday life and forget to take care of yourself. 
However, neglecting your own needs can have negative consequences for your physical and mental health. That is why it is important to make self-care a priority and recognize that taking care of yourself is not selfish, but rather necessary. By setting aside time for solitude, you can improve your mental clarity, reduce stress and anxiety, and increase your overall well-being. Not only does practicing solitude help you become more self-aware, but it also enables you to better understand your own emotions and thought patterns. So, don't forget to take a few moments each day to focus on yourself and your own needs. To conclude, spending time alone can have many benefits for our mental health, and it is important to find ways to incorporate solitude into our daily lives. Solitude can give us a chance to reflect on our thoughts and feelings and help us gain a deeper understanding of who we are as individuals. As a reminder, it is important to find a healthy balance between socializing and being alone, and to prioritize self-care in order to achieve overall well-being. We hope you found this video helpful and informative. Thank you for watching and feel free to subscribe or leave a comment below to let us know what you think. See you in the next video.